YouTube and I'm back and I would like to thank all my new subscribers. I just want you guys to know I'm a couple of, no, I'm more than a couple, but I'm getting to that hundred um, mark subscribers like I wanted to. So I will be doing a giveaway. Remember, I'll be doing a giveaway when I have a hundred subscribers. Anyway, um, I owe you guys a few videos. I owe myself a few videos. I'm so busy. I'm really trying to organize the house. Um and utilize the space that I have. I'm trying to start couponing. I'm a little fluffy, so I gotta start working on my fluffiness. Um, the, I, I think on one of my other videos, I told you the oldest is gone. He's gone off to school. And so I took over his room. It's going to be my office, my study, my room, my craft room, whatever you wanna you know, call the room. Um, when I told him I wanted to do it easy, <laughs> When I told him that I was taking over that room, and uh, because he said, well, it's like, where am I going to sleep when I come home? Son, in the guest room. You're a guest in the house. You don't encourage them. You don't make it comfortable when they come home to visit because they have to know that they have to leave. They got to go back. <laughs> They're not there to stay. So I told him, um, in the guest room, so he's like, the storage room. It won't be a storage room by the time you come back, Okay. I'm working on that. It's the guest room. So anyway, um, I'm working on that. And I'm getting ready to do another, uh, get, not another, but I'm getting ready to do a business um, venture. One that me and my best friend have been, I think, dreaming about since we were like in high school. So I'm getting ready to do that. Um, I'm about to be, you know, I got another year. Then I'm going to be the new 40, you know, the new 40. Anyway, so that's a whole other thing. So, I'm um, got a video coming up about my fluffiness. Um, I may show you some of my organization stuff that I've been doing. I'm, my laundry room, I love my laundry room. It's huge. And I'm going to paint it yellow. Yes, yellow. With some red accents. So, I'm working on that. Um, like I said, I'll show you some of my finished products, uh, projects. My husband said, if you can focus, because see, I'm not task oriented, I'll be all over the place. I'll like have five, six, seven tasks at one time and don't finish none of them. So I'm trying to get task oriented here. That's what I'm trying to do. So um, I'm working on that. Um, of course, I'm going to always keep the hauls coming because I'm always going to be ordering something. And so I'm going to do this video for my finger comber haul that I just purchased. And then I'm going to have another video that I want to talk about. You know, I really want to discuss, I read a blog on black girls, black girl long hair, black girl long hair, yeah. And it was about weaves and protective styles and not being natural. Cause I'm, we don't have to, I got to talk about that. So that's another one. And my fluffiness and what I'm going to do about my fluffiness. And then this video. So with that being said, let me get started. So anyway, you probably saw one of my other videos about my, Mar I did Marley twist and I use Marley hair. I don't know if in there I talked about the, dis the difference between the Marley hair and then the Rastafarian hair. I don't remember, but it, at this point it don't matter. And I've seen a few videos where they do the comparison of the Marley hair and the finger comber Havana twist hair. However, the Havana twist hair was used. So me personally, I couldn't really, uh, you know, see the comparison because they had been used and plus. I think you got to fill it and everything like that too. So that's another thing. But anyway, um, I ordered from Havana, from finger comber, I think on the 26th of June, somewhere in there. That day I placed my order. I ordered six bags at $12.99 per bag. And I did it through PayPal. I got my PayPal receipt. Maybe 15, 20 minutes later, they sent me an email and said it was shipped. Um, then a day or so later, I received a tracking number and I got my box Monday. No. This is a new week. I got my box last week on the 3rd or the 4th. The 3rd, I think. I got my box. So, excellent shipping. Like, excellent. No problems. That's just me. I had no problems. I didn't have a delay wait, and it's probably because they had that on hand. I've seen some because I do want to order a finger comber unit eventually. So I've seen with the finger comber units, it takes a little bit more time, probably because they have to make them or whatever they do. But with this, with my experience with finger comber and their shipping, I didn't have a problem. I didn't. Um, the twelve ninety nine was kind of steep. The I think my shipping was eight dollars. Let me check. 
because I'm going to show you the hair. Let me find this. No, my shipping was $14, so the shipping was $14.95. Um, um, anyway, so if you're interested in ordering, um, this is no new hair. It's all over YouTube. I'm not telling you anything that you don't know. But I can't think like that because there may be someone um, that's watching my channel that hasn't even heard of this hair and probably thought, well, that's Havana Twist. They use Marley hair or what are Havana Twist. They're the large twist like this. This is a picture of Havana Twist. Fingercomber.com. I will put all the information down in the description box. So they're the larger um, twist. And I had them, like I said, I did a video, but I used Marley hair to do them. I love them. I did. I just can't keep one style in for, you know, too long. So anyway, let me start this real quick. Let me find my open one. Give me one second. I think I dropped it. So here's my open one. It's in a net. I don't know what happened to my net. It fell somewhere. So it's in a net. And it's still separated by a rubber band. Now this hair, it feels like some bags of Marley hair that I've used. It even feels like the Rastafarian hair, the filling. It's a little bit more coarse. It's not as soft. And I'm going to show you the Bobby Boss Marley hair that I have. So it's not as soft. And this is... Let me see if I can really, because I'm low. Here's my, this is the length. Or maybe let me go this way. So this is the length. It's not super long either. So I know when they separate, they stretch it. And so here's the comparison, because here's the Bobby Boss. And it was the Marty here. This is something I had extra. It's softer, but as you can see, it is longer. It's way longer. Significantly. Almost, almost double, not quite. Um, Bobby Boss Marley hair, to me, is softer. It's more defined. But at the same time, I haven't tried this in a loose crochet, you know, to do it, latch and crochet and then style it. But I think I'm going to try that. I figure, hey, you know what? I'm experimenting. I'm doing my own thing. So why can't I? If it look a hot mess, I know when my hair look a hot mess, I'll take it down. Ain't nobody got to tell me, my girl, what's... Nope. I'll be honest with myself. If I got to keep, you know, like, let me see, turn here, turn here. I look a hot mess. I take it out. Period. So this is softer, more defined, and I think this will make an excellent, excellent um, style. The only thing with these, you just, like a lot of people, I don't understand why, and I, I'm going off on a, a tangent real quick, but like when we get protective styles, I call them protective styles because you're not protecting your hair. Whether you wear a weave, a uh, straight weave, curly weave, whatever it is you choose to do, you're protecting your tresses from you know, whatever your daily routine is or whatever you do type of thing. So, when you put this in your hair, it's not guaranteed to hold it. It's not like, okay, it's not going to get frizzy. It's not, it's not human hair. It's synthetic hair. So, you should, I don't understand why when you get hair, you want to style that hair. Why don't you just... Once it's in your hair and it's styled in your hair, just leave it alone. Put a bonnet on it, you know, moisturize your own natural hair underneath and go on about your business because then you get mad because you want to take it out because it wasn't working for you. Why are you styling it? It was meant, it was put in in a style, so why are you going to continue to treat it as if it's your hair? It's not. You know, I don't get, I don't understand that. Because then you want to complain and say, well, this and that. Because generally, the person who puts in your hair will tell you, look, I'm putting this in your hair 
this is the style that you can wear it in. Okay, is there any other styles I could wear it in where I won't manipulate? Yeah, you can kind of pull it back, put a scarf on and go or whatever, but don't do a whole lot of manipulation because then you're going to suffer the consequences of it later and you're going to be mad and upset and whatever's going on. So I just had to take that sidebar. So anyway, this is a hazelnut and they're real good. Well, it's dark hazelnut. It's equivalent to a four. So when you're ordering it, it may be called... Um, amber or whatever and then they'll tell you what it's equivalent to you know so this is the dark hazel so it's a number four you know i don't know girl y'all know that i've been undid something with this i'm gonna do something anywho so then i also got an amber so here's an amber and it's equivalent to a number 30 I'm telling y'all, this is Fro City. I love the natural, the natural. I got some other hair get, that I'm about to get into. Um, that I'm going to start selling myself. I got some other hair I'm about to get into. But I'm loving the natural, you know, pieces. If I can find them, I'm going to make them. I'm going to do something. But I'm loving it. So this is the 30, which goes, you know, a little bit better with my ends so I'm gonna blend that whatever I do same thing see the texture of it it's thin it's not as thick and then it's not as defined so I'm gonna work this let me pull this out perfect so you can pop that stretch it and work with it so um that's that. So I wanted to let everybody know, I know you really can't get the full understanding of the two comparisons. I know that's kind of difficult. I will take a still shot, some still shot photos so you can see it in case you were, you know, wanted to know. I'm going to only be able to tell you, that, like I said, these bags are $12.99 versus Bobby Boss, the Marley hair is $5.99. So I'm going to work with it and play with it a little bit whenever... I take out my, um, we just a whole nother video about these mini twists. Oh, hell, I'm going to have to hook up with the ones that's rocking the mini twists and they trying to do a challenge. Thanks, Chrissy. She told me about it. So I'm working on trying to locate them because my hair, that's a whole nother video. So I'm going to work this hair and then do a few styles and I'm going to give you my honest opinion. Is it worth you paying $12.99 a bag for? Or is it better just to pay $5.99 per bag for this and you can go get as many bags as you need and you still probably won't pay as much as for the Havana hair. The Havana hair. Havana. I don't know. I have to see. I gotta see. So, anyway, if you have any comments, any questions, anything you want to say, just say it. Because I'm just going to say it. And so smooches until we talk again. See you later.